Hi Sagittarius, welcome back to my channel Real Love Stories. Today I'm going to do your psychic love readings for the month of uh, September. Keep in mind that these readings are general. This may be resonant with you or may be not resonant with each and every one of you. If it resonates with you, take guidance from these readings and if it not resonates with you, you can simply ignore it. Let's get started Sagittarius. What are the Sagittarius persons feeling, thinking and intentions towards Sagittarius? What are the Sagittarius persons thinking, feeling and intentions towards Sagittarius? What are the Sagittarius persons feeling, thinking and intentions towards Sagittarius? And we are having here Devil, Ace of Cups, Wow, Two of Cups, Five of Pentacles, that, that's Wow. What are the Sagittarians feeling, thinking, and intentions toward this person? What are the Sagittarians feeling, thinking, and intentions toward this person? Queen of Swords, Temperance, Eight of Swords, King of Wands. What are the mutual energies? Page of Wands, Two of Pentacles. These are your cards and signs that could relate it to your person. Taurus Virgo Capricorn with this Two of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, Cancer Scorpio Pisces with this Two of Cups, Ace of Cups, Capricorn with this Devil, Aries Leo Sagittarius with this Page of Wands, King of Wands, Gemini Libra Aquarius with this uh, Eight of Wands, Sword and Queen of Sword, Sagittarius with this Temperance. Energies, your person's energies right now really heavy. This person is in darkness. This person is in some kind of you know when you feel like that everything is just in it is a black magic you know we feel that you know something sometime things happens and we totally get scared and we just you know we are brave and we know that it's like the black and darkness around us so they are just there they just the karmic pull there they can't get rid of their partner and they want to get rid of their partner and then they just like can't they, they wanna be they want want to be there like it's it's like a parasite sometimes you know we we want to get rid of that but it's like a drug in our veins and we can't get rid of this drug that kind of you know the energies around this person and this person you know this two of cups amazing like totally right now obsessed over this soulmate connection this partner right now the focus main focus partner partner potential partner think about you when they think about you they are just getting obsessed they just feel this pull towards you they can't you know get rid of your thoughts and these thoughts you are the potential partner for them this person wants to re reunite with you because they feel some kind of connection towards you and they can't you know they, they are not getting enough of you they are just keep dragging themselves being drowning in this obsession and in this you know thought and emotionally this person is really warmed overwhelmed and really emotional towards you this you know this this is the emotions the, it's like when i teary eyes when tears in a person's eye and they're just holding it a bit more longer just controlling that the the feel when we controlling our fear up our tears that's the thing that kind of emotional emotionally overwhelmed this person right now and they are helplessly suffering they know that you will never ever going to compromise with them on their terms what they want no you can't compromise you you never you know so this person is helplessly uh, suffering and feel abandoned and this person want to you know if you no solution it's a, not a remedy for them you leave them you left them it's not a remedy it's a total backfire on them they become more obsessed they become just you know they just drowning into this and they want this reunion and emotionally this person is such a wreck totally emotionally totally complicated and totally you know into you you are strict toward this person you really don't want to fall into being naive anymore so you are just cutting this person off 
and you want a balance in your life. You're done this person the way they're playing with you. When you just gather yourself and just being warrior and you collect your own energies to put for your well being. You are balancing your energies. You are just want to satisfy yourself. You want to secure yourself. And you are just radiant because of these thoughts, the way you are taking care of your health, your love life, your financial life, inside out, it's make you attractive. Overthinking in you, some kind of, you know, stuckness in you, you are thinking too much about a certain point. Some, you know, sometimes it's happened, some loopholes, few pieces left. We doubt. We think this person, no. No future with this person. But still, few vibrations, few hints, this person's this behavior, again, something left, you know, something there. Even you think, no, we can't and all that. It's become toxic. Whenever we try that, we being us become toxic. So, but still something there. Can't completely get rid of these uh, things and can't completely take all this connection. You are in your fiery energy. You are in your full power with all your powerful decision your willpower and your decisions your charisma your charm your social status you can get you can get at anyone you can easily just you know all you need to do just to say it i want that person and you want that kind of person you will get anyone you are in this you in you develop this confidence in you you are confident with your personality and you are overthinking some kind of you know stuckness and you are trying to be you know being balanced in your life and the queen of wands so totally cutting this person and this passion this passion this situation is bigger than this person for them it's hard to manage and hard to control this passion I think this person is falling in love with you all over again and you are the drug for them. They are not getting enough of you. And they want to, you know, just, they want to leave, but they can't. They left, but still there. And with this two of pentacles, you know that this person always juggle with multiple things. That's why they are in this position. They they need to drop one. They are losing the balance. You need to choose one. This person not deciding, not choosing. This is you getting from this person. Let's see what else we have for you, Sagittarius. What else we have for us, Sagi? And we are having here nine of wands, four of pentacles, ace of wands. This person hurt in their past. A lot of thoughts in their head, a lot of emotions in their head, in, in, in them. But they really don't want to get hurt by you again. And some, you know, any any point of view, any angle, they really don't want to get hurt. You secure yourself, you are protecting your heart chakra here. And you really don't want to get hurt from by this person. Both not letting their guard off. Both don't want to be vulnerable in front of each other. Passion and idea between you two. There is a whole new passion there. This person want this passion at the beginning too with you. Totally obsessed over you. Totally in this, you know, karmic pull kind of situation. They think you are you are their soulmate and they think you are their, you know, the karmic soulmate. The both feelings they having for you. And there is a want to have a new fresh start with you. Let's see what else we have for you. Sagittarius. Nine of sword, ten of cup, eight of cups, and ten of sword. Seriously, something a big happened between you two in upcoming days. This situation leading towards dragging you to the sadness and disappointment. This person totally restless, sleepless losing their nights over you you are disappointed on this person you are just totally in a pessimistic way walking away from this person totally disappointed and both of you really sad whatever happening between you two what will happen between you two what just happened in past between you two 
all of it making you guys really sad let's see what your angel want to add in this reading take action you are in touch with your truth in the situation and you need to trust your gut and loving assert yourself right now you need to take action instead of being depressed and sad let's see what advice messages fight back have faith make peace with your memories no matter what it's good or it's bad meditate it's time to choose these are few advice messages in the end and summary of your reading is this person is totally obsessed over this and over you because you are like a black magic for them and they are drowning in this black hole left alone helpless but emotional towards you anxieties depression restless sleepless losing their nights over you and you are trying to balance your energy and you really don't want this person to use you again disappointment and you are reserving yourself sadness these are some reasons of your readings hope this helpful for you thank you god bless you bye